I was really nervous about diving with Robbie to begin with. He's a legend in cave diving. I think what Robbie's done and achieved should put him on a par with any of the great explorers of history. He's explored at least 300 kilometers of cave underwater. He's phenomenally experienced. It's difficult to put into context how important what he's done is. He should be considered alongside the Amelia Earharts and the Shackletons and the Mallorys. What he's done is extraordinary. You don't get adrenaline junkies. You don't get people who have, you know, a, a desire to risk their lives in this kind of enterprise because they just wouldn't last five minutes. It's exactly the opposite. It's a desire to take control of your own life. The worst thing could happen would be like the cave collapse. Mm. That is something you couldn't be trained for, you couldn't be prepared for. Um, but that's very, very rare, very little. I, I had in 20 years one moment where like a big rock came back down behind me and total zero visibility and in just like feeling my way through and I was able to get over it and f in, in almost panic I, my stress level was really really high fell down the other side of the rock and with, for pure luck I fell with my hand on the guy line And still swimming out the rest of the dive, I was sure I would die. But that happened in 20 years once. People coming here, overconfidence, people think they're bigger than the cave, they're not.